now we are going to check the steady state thermal analysis so it is used to determine the temperature distribution and total heat flux in this analysis all the heat transfer modes that is conduction convection radiation are being analyzed so we should know the basics conduction is the process of heat transfer between the bodies which are in contact then convection convection is the process of heat transfer in which the medium of heat transfer is fluid and in case of radiation it is the mode of heat transfer in which the heat is transferred through space then temperature gradient it is the rate of change of temperature per unit depth in material then heat flux it is the rate of heat transfer per unit cross sectional area then film coefficient it is the measure of heat transfer through thin film so let's start we should know these basics initially let's import in a geometry we need to generate it let's create mesh then select steady state thermal node from tree outline we can apply temperature on a particular surface give any particular value of temperature in degree celsius after that we can add convection or radiation i am applying convection we can give a particular value or else we can import the data it is selected when the surrounding air is considered to be stagnant after that select solution node we can check the temperature distribution and also we can check the total heat flux in the details of temperature and total heat flux we have selected geometry as a all bodies if you want to check the temperature distribution on any surface then we can select the surface also under geometry press apply and we can solve it so this is the temperature distribution along the whole body then total heat flux if we increase the number of elements in the mesh then we can get better result 